are going to start exercise 11.2 of introduction to trigonometry. Let's start with the first sum of the first Roman number. First sum, sin 60 into cos 30 plus sin 30 into cos 60. Sin 60 is root 3 upon 2. Cos 30 is also root 3 upon 2. Plus sin 30 is 1 upon 2 and cos 60 is also 1 upon 2. Root 3 into root 3 is 3. 2 into 2 is 4. Plus 1 into 1 is 1. 2 into 2 is 4. 3 plus 1, 4 upon 4. 4 ones are 4 ones are. This is equal to 1. So, answer is 1. Second sum is 2 and square 45 plus cos square 30 minus sin square 60. 2 into and 45 is 1. So, 1 square plus cos 30 root 3 upon 2. Root 3 upon 2 square minus sin 60 is also root 3 upon 2 square is equal to 2 into 1. 1 square is 1. Root 3 upon 2 whole square is 3 upon 4 minus root 3 upon 2 whole square 3 upon 4 plus 3 upon 4 minus 3 upon 4 gets cancelled. 2 into 1. Answer is 2. Third sum cos 45 upon sec 30 plus cos sec 30. Cos 45 is 1 upon root 2 upon sec 30 is reciprocal of cos 30. Cos 30 is root 3 upon 2. So sec 30 is 2 upon root 3. 2 upon root 3 plus cos sec 30. Cos sec 30 is reciprocal of sin 30. Sin 30 is 1 upon 2. So cos sec 30 is 2 upon 1. Let's solve this. 1 upon root 2 as it is upon. Here, LCM of this denominator is root 3. So, numerator is 2 plus 2 root 3. Okay. Now, what we get here? This is equal to 1 upon root 2 into root 3 upon 2 plus 2 root 3. Let us solve this. What we get here after solving? Multiply this. Root 3 upon 2 into root 2 is 2 root 2. Root 2 into 2 root 2 is plus 2 root 6. Now this is what we get after solving. But Denominator should be always a rational number. If it is not a rational number, we have to make it rational by using the rationalizing factor. Now, how to rationalize the denominator? We have already learnt in our previous class. That is in standard 9. So, here the rationalizing factor is 2 root 2 minus 2 root 6. So, our numerator as well as denominator, we have to multiply with the rationalizing factor into 2 root 2 minus 2 root 6. 2 root 2 minus 2 root 6. Let us multiply this. Root 3 into 2 root 2 is 2 root 6 minus root 3 into minus 2 root 6 is 2 root 8 upon here a plus b into a minus b 2 root 2 square minus 2 root 
six square. Okay. Now here in numerator, this eighteen, eighteen we can split it as nine into two, and square root of nine, that is three, will come out of the root sign. So here numerator becomes two root six minus two into three, that is six root two, upon Two root two square four into two is eight minus two root six whole square four into six twenty four. Okay. Now here two root six minus six root two. Let us take two as a common factor. Root six minus three root two upon eight minus twenty four eight. Minus twenty four is minus sixteen. Two ones are two eights. Now our final answer is minus root six three root two upon eight. This we can also write as see minus sign. Let us apply to this bracket. Three root two minus root six upon eight. This is the final answer of this sum. Actually, in such type of sums, you have to just substitute the values here of these ratios and just go on solving properly till you reach one final answer. Fourth sum. Sin thirty plus tan forty five minus cos sixty upon sec thirty plus cos sixty plus cot forty five. Okay, sin thirty is one upon two. Tan forty five is one. Cos sixty. Cos sec means reciprocal of sin. Sin sixty is root three upon two. So cos sixty is two upon root three. Upon Sec thirty. Sec thirty is reciprocal of cos thirty. Cos thirty is root three upon two. So sec thirty is two upon root three plus cos sixty is one upon two. Cot forty five is one. Okay. Let us solve this numerator. Here LCM is two root three. So what are going to be our numerators? Here, root three plus two root three minus four. Upon even here, our LCM is two. Let us write here two root three. Here, numerator becomes four plus here root three. Plus two root three. Fine. Now, if you have the same denominator, okay. If you have the same denominators in numerator as well as denominator, we can straight away cancel that. Now, what is remaining? Let us write that here. Root three plus two root three minus four upon. Uh, let us write something like this: root three plus two root three plus four. Root three plus two root three is three root three minus four upon again root three plus two root three. Three root three plus four. Now what we have to rationalize the denominator: three root three. Minus four upon three root three plus four into three root three minus four upon three root three minus four. Okay. Now here three root three minus four into three root three minus four. It's something like a minus b whole square. A minus b whole square. So it's a square. That is three. Root three square minus two 
ए बी प्लस बी स्क्वेर एंड डिनोमिनेटर ए प्लस बी इंटू ए माइनस बी सो इट इज थ्री रूट थ्री स्क्वेर माइनस फोर स्क्वेर नो वॉट वी गेट इन न्यूमरेटर लेट सी थ्री रूट थ्री होल स्क्वेर नाइन इंटू थ्री नाइन थ्री इज ट्वेंटी सेवन माइनस टू इंटू थ्री इंटू फोर टू थ्री जो सिक्स सिक्स फोर जो ट्वेंटी फोर ट्वेंटी फोर रूट थ्री ट्वेंटी फोर रूट थ्री प्लस सिक्सटीन अपॉन अपॉन थ्री रूट थ्री होल स्क्वेर नाइन इंटू थ्री ट्वेंटी सेवन माइनस फोर स्क्वेर इज सिक्सटी ट्वेंटी सेवन प्लस सिक्सटीन ट्वेंटी सेवन प्लस सिक्सटीन इज फोर्टी थ्री माइनस ट्वेंटी फोर रूट थ्री अपॉन ट्वेंटी सेवन माइनस सिक्सटीन इज इलेवन दिस इज अवर फाइनल आंसर फोर्टी थ्री माइनस ट्वेंटी फोर रूट थ्री अपॉन इलेवन फिफ्थ सम फाइव कॉस स्क्वायर सिक्सटी कॉस सिक्सटी इज वन अपॉन टू ओके स्क्वायर प्लस फोर सेक थर्टी सेक इज रेसिप्रोकल ऑफ कॉस कॉस थर्टी इज रूट थ्री अपॉन टू सो सेक थर्टी इज टू अपॉन रूट थ्री होल स्क्वायर माइनस टेन स्क्वायर फोर्टी फाइव टेन फोर्टी फाइव is one one square upon sine thirty is one upon two and cos thirty is root three upon two square. Let's solve this here. Five into one upon four plus four into four upon three minus one upon Denominator one upon two whole square is one upon four plus root three upon two whole square is three upon four. Numerator five upon four plus sixteen upon three minus one upon denominator is four upon four. Four upon four means denominator becomes one. Let us cancel here. Four ones are four ones. Now we will have to simplify only numerator. What we have here in the numerator? Five upon four plus sixteen upon three minus one. Five. LCM. Four three one. LCM is twelve. Four threes are twelve. So five threes are fifteen. Three fours are twelve. Sixteen into four. Sixty-four minus twelve. Okay. Fifteen minus twelve, three. Sixty-four plus three is sixty-seven. Sixty-seven upon twelve is the answer. Now, let's convert it to mixed fraction. Finally, twelve fives are sixty-seven upon twelve. So here we complete first row number of exercise eleven point two. We will continue the next sums in our next video. Thank you so much for watching this video.